Dude, today I'm going to be doing a review on my new TaylorMade Rocket Blades 2 arms. Right now I've got the, uh, I'm going to hit the 7 arm for you. Speed slot, Rocket Blades 2 are KBS stiff shaft. looks it's a good looking club it's pretty thin top line thin bottom line so it gets through the turf really well i like that a lot um, you can definitely tell that the speed slot gives you a little more yardage so i'll hit a couple shots real quick and just tell you how they go i might try to shape some in a second so i'm just going to try it straight right now These clubs, they uh, they give me a, a little bit higher ball flight than my last clubs, and I really like that. Yeah, I think these shafts do it because these shafts are a little bit, a little bit heavier, so they make me hit a little higher. So I'll try a little draw. right around 155 yards that's just pretty common for me I'm 13 years old I'm a pretty big hitter for my age uh, with my driver and everything but with my driver I probably average 255 260 uh, today I was just playing and we just got a lot of rain so the course is a little wet and uh, uh, I carried one 230 so, because the ball actually backed up out of the divot, you could see it. So, yeah. So, I just hit four really good shots. And, uh, uh, for my initial, for looks, I give it a five out of five in rating. For, like, sound, probably a five out of five. Uh, feel, for sound and feel, I'll give it five out of five. Um,. Workability, probably four out of five. Um, added distance, five out of five. So, I mean, yeah, they've given me a lot more yardage and everything. So, I mean, my old seven arm was only going about 
140, and I've gained about 15 yards per club, basically. So, and it's making me hit it probably 15, 20 yards higher. Uh, like, honestly, so, I mean, yeah, I would definitely recommend these irons to somebody else. So, I was hitting those from probably 10 yards in front of the green off the fairway, and uh, these balls are, let's see, I'm coming up to them. There, one of them's in this bunker over here. So there's 150 steak right there and a plate in the ground. And these are, let's see, these are out here. Let's see, I'll step it off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. So twenty-two to the closest to the shortest one, right here. And then the longest one, if you can see it, is another probably twenty yards. So we'll step that off as well. So let's go there. One two three four five six here let me stop and get this other one real quick but it's still out there so i just picked up this one right here so there's another one out there put it in the basket seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four so twenty four steps so that's 44 steps past the 150 marker. So 40, that's 44, there's 200 marker right there. So that's probably 10 yards short of it. So that's, well, I mean, there's a little wind behind me too. So it's not a lot, but there's still a little bit. So uh, that's probably 170 yards, honestly. So that's a really good. Well, and that's maybe a little bit of roll, not much. Because these, I mean, it's getting dried out right in here, but over here it's still really wet. But, yeah, that's my review on these TaylorMade Rocket Blade Tour irons. Really like them, really enjoy them. Uh, yeah, I would definitely recommend them. Go hit them at your local Golf Smith Golf Galaxy or Edwin Watts. And comment what you think about them. And uh, like, rate, uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks.